Hey, Erica here. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a round version of a picture in Canva for your email signature or a blog post signature or whenever you just want a round picture. Oh, especially the about me section on your WordPress site. But yeah, stay tuned. Scroll down to, I like logo size. If you want it huge, you know, you can do a bigger Instagram post, but you just click on logo. Okay, so once you're in here, um, you're going to go to Elements. Go to, it's one of my frequently saved, so down here they put in frames. If you want it to be square, you can use grid, but since we want it round, we're going to choose the circle frame. And then go to Uploads. If you don't have the picture in here that you want, you know, click Upload and add that picture. If you already have it. I have to scroll all the way down <laughs> to get to the picture I want. And then you can also stretch this out too so you get maximum space taken up. So today I have to do two. I have to do mine and my PR girl, my team members as well. I think I do have both of our pictures in here. So scroll down. Okay, so here's her picture. So you just, you can do this two ways. You can click and it go like that. You scroll up and it makes it full size. Or the other way, you can have my picture. Oh, the search is on. <laughs> Where's the picture I want to use? Let me pause this so y'all don't see me scroll. So the other way is you grab the picture and you drop it. Ta-da! <laughs> oh god, what happened? Here, let me try one more time. Okay, let's look at it there. So now to save these, I'm just going to say... um about pick and then I want to just download each one I don't feel like running around um, looking for these in the files so I'm going to do each page at a time as a PNG oh oh my gosh I forgot to click the transparent background oh no it's fine to have a white background the lady in the example had a white background so that's fine but if you want it to have a transparent background, um, you click this box. But I'm literally following along with a tutorial about how to set up my Gmail signature finally, <laughs> three years later after in business. So I'm just following along what she did. Okay. If this is your first time watching with me, you know that my computer has so many files on it that it is slow okay and then same thing with the second picture all right that is all thanks for watching if you enjoyed this tutorial please like and subscribe and let me know in the comments below what you want to see next